Hi everyone. In this video, I am explaining about the concept of what is per unit system, why it is required in power system calculations. The electric power transmission lines are operated at very high voltage levels and transmits a large amount of power. Hence, the operating voltage of transmission line is expressed in kilovolt and power transmitted is expressed in kilowatt or megawatt and kilovolt amperes or megavolt amperes. Then, the various components of power systems like alternators, motors, transformers, etc. have their voltage, power, current and impedance ratings in kV, kVA and Ka and ohms respectively. The components are various sections of power system may operate at different voltage and power levels. It is an important point. It will be convenient for analysis of power system if the voltage, power, current and impedance ratings of uh, components of power system are expressed with reference to a common value called base value. Hence, for analysis purpose, a base value is chosen for voltages, power, current and impedance. Then, all the voltage, power, current and impedance ratings of the components are expressed as a percent or per unit of the base value. According to the definition, the per unit value of any quantity is defined as the ratio of actual value of the quantity to the base value or a arbitrary selected value. For power system calculations, when equivalent circuit are drawn, the different components will be at different voltages which are connected together in a system by means of transformers and interconnection. Each apparatus is rated in kVA and its impedance in ohms or in percentage value referring to its rated kVA and rated voltage. These direct calculations are very complex and in fact impossible due to very large network of power systems. So, this per unit method simplifies the calculations as all the quantities are expressed in terms of PU that is per unit. Moreover, this method is particularly suited for the circuit where there is a change in voltages that is in transformer circuits. In order to calculate the per unit value of any quantity, we will consider the expression as per unit value is equal to actual value by base value. We will represent it in terms of percentage that is percentage of per unit value is equal to actual value by base value into 100. 